This is the story of one of the greatest fighter pilots who is a Bangladesh. The greatest, one of the greatest fighter pilots of this entire world. His name is Saiful Azam. Saiful Azam was a Bangladeshi. He was born in 1941 in a district called Pabna. He's the only fighter pilot in this entire world who served in war for three air forces, Pakistan, Jordan, Iraq. And he served for four air forces, Bangladesh, Pakistan, Jordan, Iraq. And he shot down five enemy aircrafts in dogfights, one Indian, four Israeli. Let me tell you the story. Saiful Azam joined Pakistan Air Force Academy in 1958 in Risalpur. After commission, he was sent to Arizona Luke Air Force Base, USA, 1961. There, he underwent bombing, dogfight, strifing, so many other things. And he was so good with his aircraft that he was given the certificate called Top Gun. Many of us heard that Top Gun movie and we see all those things, but he was the real Top Gun. He was so good. After returning, he worked as instructor in various Pakistani bases. He was very specialized in saber jets. In 1965, when India-Pakistan war broke down, he was given a mission to bomb some place. While returning, his formation was attacked by Indian Air Force. He shot one Indian Air Force down. And because of this gallantry achievement, he was given third highest gallantry award, Sitara Azurra. 1967, he was sent to Royal Jordanian Air Force as an advisor and instructor. Jordanian Air Force were using, they had a very small Air Force, they were using basic British-made Hawker Hunters. In June 1967, six days Arab-Israel war broke out. And the very first day of the war, Israeli Air Force took out 450 aircraft from Iraq, and from Egypt, and Syrian Air Force. Next target was Jordanian Air Force. And they had only 25 basic Hawker Hunters, as I mentioned. So the king, Jordanian King Talal, requested Saiful Azam, will you volunteer and fight for us? And he said, yes. On 5th June, he took off from Mafruk Air Base. Soon after taking off, Israeli Air Force came in. And Israeli Air Force had advanced dissolved Mistray, Mirage, Vatur, all these top-notch supersonic fighter planes and bombers. And that default, that uh, Hawker Hunter, Mr. Azam was flying, was subsonic. And that Israelis were supersonic. Soon after taking off, he shot down one dissolved mystery. Then he chased others. There were a total six Israeli aircrafts in that attack formation. He shot down one. His wingman shot down another one. And after a while, Mr. Azam shot down another dissolved mystery. So he had two confirmed kills on 5th June 1967. The Air Force base they took off, Israelis, they destroyed that. So they couldn't land there. They had to land in Amman after that mission. While they were trying to refuel and set up armaments, Israeli Air Force came and destroyed the entire Amman Air Force base, uh, international airport. On 7th, within 48 hours, on 7th, June, from Jordan, pilots, including Mr. Azam, were sent to Iraq because the next attack was coming to Iraq. And Iraq was also flying, Iraq Air Force, that Hawker Hunter. Mr. Saiful Azam went there, volunteered, flew that aircraft, faced Israelis, and guess what? Within 72 hours, within next sortie for Iraq Air Force, he shot down a Mirage. Crazy. He shot down a Mirage within 72 hours hours, three confirmed kills. And then he saw 2,000, 2,500 feet down, there is a Vatur bomber, Israeli bomber. Because normally fighters and bombers, they come in formation. And he went down, performed a very acrobatic S maneuver, and he went so close and started firing with his heavy cannon that Israeli bomber dismantled and that crash landed. So within 72 hours, he had three confirmed kills, one crash landing. And in 65, he also shot down another Indian Air Force aircraft five total that's why in 2000 he was given one of the highest certification that is called living eagles people like neil armstrong gets that he is a bangladeshi he was a bangladeshi he died yesterday he took his last breath yesterday mr saiful azam 
after Liberation War 1971, he came back to Bangladesh and served for Bangladesh Air Force as well. So as a Bangladeshi, I take tremendous pride that we have produced one of the best Air Force fighter pilots the entire world has ever seen. So please, when you think about Bangladesh, aviation industry, fighter pilots and everything, remember this name, Group Captain Retired Saiful Azam, Living Eagle, Top Gun. As an ex-military personnel, I show my tremendous respect to this gentleman.